i'm going to go straight into the point i'm going to go straight to the point <laughs> and the point of this video is to talk about the suspension and of course the arrest of the um cbn governor is now the i don't know suspended cbn governor because it's an acting governor and i'm going to delve into what actually happened because you know on social media a lot of nitrogen's nigerians are saying different things different reasons why this man was suspended you know having just a few days ago it was in a meeting with the president of the nation president bala hamed tunobu hey hey kasala don hey hey i'm sure we are all aware that a uh, emi failure has been suspended why some people are saying that a uh, Tinubu does not have rights to suspend him. Some say he was sacked, but in long run, he has been removed. And that is what a supporters of a Tinubu have been looking forward to. And some people will believe that a Emifele made them to suffer because of his a, policies and what have you. And I've been saying it right from time that Emifele did not act on his own. But that is not even what we are saying. Now we know that a, after he has been suspended, Tinubu has already appointed somebody as acting a cbn governor then after that dss arrested him they will question him before you know it like i said they will remove him they will allow him to go but the board of contention now is that uh, mfla is ready to speak you know i was saying this issue of a bullion van and bullion van is tinubu when i just look at the whole scenario because we are hearing it wiki now that he's praising tinubu for sacking or suspending I say both say the one who ordered the sack, the one that they sack, and the one who is even cheering them up. Have we are we not aware of their shenanigans, their records and their own antecedents? And I made mention of that uh, the so-called uh, bullion van. If it were to be, of course, somebody who is not even uh, with the government of the day will not even try that uh, bullion van uh, saga that happened under Buhari in 2019. He won't do it. He dare it. He tried it because he knew for for a fact that uh, they are in the same party, and nothing will happen. And nothing happens to today. And when I hear the Jaden you talking about uh, that one, I uh, don't even know where it belongs to because now it's been it's been it's appearing like television with no clear. Now he's beginning to talk some things against Tinubu, and the he's not even bold to even talk about Tinubu. Like unlike the way he was talking about the bullion van, all of a sudden. He's not saying anything, but Emefele is ready to talk. Tell me, who gave Emefele or who gave Tinumbu that permission or the bullion van? Or does it mean that, that uh, Tinumbu had a or he has a, a, a bank? No, he doesn't have. Even if he has a bank, it must be under the supervision of the central gov uh, central bank governor. Because which, of course, Tinumbu does not even have a, a bank. So who gave him those bullion vans? See, all these guys, they, they are just playing with our intelligence. All this uh, money redesign, Buario, and all of that, all of them are game where they play. And some people are not still getting it. All of them, their hands are, they have soiled their hands in all manner of dirty things. If you do anything, this one will talk. You think that uh, Mifele does not have a, a lot of secret things. Why is it that uh, it's even all the allegations of uh, terrorism and what have you against uh, Mifele? Who is saying anything again today? Nobody is saying it. The same APC, because this man was able to join APC. He was not supposed to be a, a he was not supposed to be partisan or a member of any political party. But APC, they loved him. He joined their party to the extent that he wanted to vie for the position of a, the president. They didn't say anything. They didn't see anything wrong because he was doing their bidding. All of a sudden, because he wanted to contest for the position of governor. See, all these, see these guys, eh, the more you look in this country, eh, hmm, the more you look, the less you see. Forget all of them are the same. They will come on the pages of newspaper. They will come on social media. They will come on uh, the conventional media houses and be lambasting themselves. They know where they meet. They know where they meet. And that is the same thing some people are saying that... Eh, it's like a, a Buari. There are some secrets that a Tinubu or Buari has with a Tinubu that at the end of the day, Buari just changed all of a sudden because some people saw the leg that a Buari was carrying against a Tinubu, but all of a sudden, Buari started changing. For somebody who called himself a president, voted and showed your word, this is the person I voted for. What kind of credibility, what kind of a integrity do you think that person has? And you think there's no nothing more than that so all of them they know themselves for Buari to have even retained Emefele after 2015 you know 
he speaks volume. Maybe that's why some people are saying that, uh, oh, but uh, the question is that good luck Jonathan was able to remove uh, Sanusina because somebody said, oh, uh, 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 there was no way Buari would have removed him. I said, but uh, good luck Jonathan removed uh, Sanusi. Everyone did not fall. Did you think uh, that Sanusi Lamido finished his tenor before good luck Jonathan removed him because they perceived he was going against them? Because Ewe Fele was doing the bidding of Buari and the Northern Kabas. That was why they left him to this moment. They shielded him while APC and their whatever were crying. Whether the cry was genuine, which I don't, I believe they are crying in the first place because I felt want, it wanted to affect them. But at the end of the day, I just felt that they just, there is script written and they played out the script and a lot of people fell for it. Some people have been able to get that these people deceived us, but some people are still following them. So, believe you me. Amy Fele will be released because he knows too much. Tinubu himself cannot even go further. Who gave it Amy Fele or Tinubu himself? Who gave him? Who um, assigned a bullion vans to him? Because Tinubu himself accepted that it was his money. Who gave you bullion van with the policy or with the law that says that a money laundry when you you you, you are caught with a sante amount of money. It costs money laundry, but under APC, under Buhari, all of them, it meant nothing, which an ordinary person cannot do. You will see people, he would, he would have been arrested. He would have been arrested. So, arresting Emi Felena is just to bobo Nigerians. Before you know it, they go release them. They go release them because if not, Kasala is ready to speak, is ready to talk. Is ready to talk because all of them, they know the damage they have caused this country. You can't tell me that they are not in the same cartel. But the gullible Nigerians, gullible ones, of course, they will they will fall in for fall for all this kind of a thing. Just like the Bible says that uh, you will continue to have poor people among you, and that is why you continue to have gullible and psychophants. When I got that rema, that no matter what you say, that any government that will be coming or any government of the day you must see people that you will always tend to align with them and so that is why it will be difficult for people to come unanimously to say no enough is enough even those who have been oppressed they celebrate their oppressors so what we are saying now is that uh, what is about to happen now is that Emi Fele is ready to open his mouth he's ready to open his mouth and say all that he knows but I know say even Tinubu said no go fit. Go for that. Before you know, they will just remove her. Make it go. They will tell you they are investigating. Invest in this, invest in that. Just to bubble Nigeria. So that it won't be as if they, oh, with all these things that happened and they are just leaving him to just go uh, scot free. No. Mm -mm. They are just doing that because nothing, nothing that uh, this uh, man called the Mifele did without the knowledge of Buhari. Did you hear President say anything? They were so happy with uh, what he carried out. So it didn't work uh, in isolation. So guys, uh, that's just what is happening. Nobody should deceive anybody. We have believed these people uh, for a long time and we've discovered that they have nothing to offer. You now see that a uh, criminal is arresting, arresting criminal. <laughs> just like some people are now, APC chieftains are saying that uh, this is the time for Tinubu to deal with uh, Obasanjo, that he will not be able to write any all those letters that he used to write all those uh, past uh, presidents. And people say, for where he said, you know, go fit now. Tinubu no go fit. They just want to use it to bobo all of it that say, oh, they are trying, they are doing something. At the end of the day, nothing will come out of it. So, guys, let's hear your opinion on what take this.